What's up you guys, welcome to the Single Guy channel and today I'm gonna to be talking about how to give good eye contact. Giving good eye contact is one of the most powerful tools that you can have in conversation. In the modern age, eye contact is getting worse. With all of our computers, all of our phones, with all of our television screens that we're staring at, we're not used to looking at other people. We're not used to being with other people. And if you can give good eye contact, it's going to put you above the rest of the average population. One of the things that a good eye contact can do is it allows you to really build a connection with the person that you're talking about. I mean, eye contact is a very intimate thing to do with someone. If you're speaking to someone, even if it's at a bar or a club or something with a very loud environment where there are a lot of distractions, if you have good eye contact in the conversation, you can make the person or the girl feel like she's the only girl in the club and it's just you two talking, even if there's like people dancing around you or if there's like loud music or distractions. Good eye contact kind of allows you to zone in and have this intimate moment between each other. And if you do it right, you're gonna make her feel special and you're gonna make you yourself special as well. One of the guys who I think is one of the best at giving eye contact is Bill Clinton. So if you wanna check out some videos on him, there's tons where they talk about how good his eye contact is. I would check them out, dude. I mean, Bill Clinton's the man when it comes to this sort of stuff. He's one of the most charismatic guys out there. So I came up with a bunch of things that I think will allow you guys to get better eye contact. The first tip for giving good eye contact is to practice giving eye contact. Now, if you're walking down the street or you're, you know, in your everyday, if you live in the city or if you're walking past people, you know, there's going to be that occasion where you make eye contact with a girl on the street or maybe she's across the street or maybe it's in your class or something like that. Try holding eye contact for just a second longer than you usually hold it for because usually when we make eye contact with a stranger or another person, we tend to look away pretty quickly. But if you're really confident, the really confident guys hold it for just a second longer. Holding eye contact shows an incredible amount of confidence. Really unconfident people, I find, tend to show a lot less eye contact than people who are confident. Uh, the second thing is, is practice being present to the moment. Being present to the moment is such a hugely important factor and the basis for a lot of the things that people talk about in the pickup community or in dating or in whatever it is, is you want to be present to what's happening with you. Don't be thinking about what's happening in the past. Don't be thinking about, does this girl like me? Is she, uh, is she looking away? Is she gonna go to her friend? Does she think I'm a creep? Don't be having those voices in your head. Just concentrate on what she's saying or concentrate on what you're saying. Be in the moment, be in the conversation. That's what's gonna help you build a connection with that person. And when you're in the moment, like you're gonna do the eye contact, you're gonna do a lot of the things that you should be doing that I give tips on. Uh, but you're going to be doing them naturally. So one of the best ways to maintain being present to the moment um, is to concentrate on things that are happening right now. Practice meditating. Practice focusing on your breathing. Don't be looking at your phone or your computer screens or all that stuff and be having yourself distracted. What you want to do is you want to be where you are right now and deal with it. Being cool with silence is also another way that you can do this as well. Another good tip, because sometimes being present in the moment and all this stuff is good, but when you're talking to a girl who's like really hot or a girl that you really like, you're gonna get nervous and you're gonna start like getting, doing nervous things like looking away, checking your phone, doing all of these things because it's, it's a tough experience and it can be kind of uncomfortable when you're making eye contact with somebody. So what you wanna do is shoot for 90% eye contact and focus on that. If you maintain 90% percent eye contact that's good enough where you're focusing on a lot of what you're saying they can tell this guy is all in he's giving a hundred percent in this conversation and they can tell that you're really paying attention to what they're saying however there are some people out there that are going to give too much eye contact. Now, sometimes a lot, especially guys who are kind of maybe in the autistic spectrum, um, they tend to give too much. So they'll be staring at you like this all the time and you'll just be like, okay, dude, this is <laughs> this is getting a little weird. If you've been staring at the person for more than 10 seconds, uh, you gotta look away. Take a break, maybe kind of look. Um, you know, I'll, I'll do like little things or like maybe I'll, maybe I'll give a smile or look down or whatever. Just take a little bit of a break. Make it natural, don't make it abrupt. Um, and that's kind of more of a natural uh, way that people maintain eye contact and it shows still that you're giving it still shows that you're paying attention to what they're saying um, but it also shows that maybe you're taking time to think about it and you're not totally being just <laughs> uh, just totally being creepy the other thing I like to do when I'm when I'm uh, giving eye contact with people is I like to smile with my eyes too um, giving a warm smile with your eyes is something that you can work on when you smile you use your whole face not just your mouth so your eyes if they're smiling they're a little 
little bit more open um, and they're focused on the other person. So you don't want to have your eyes too wide and be staring at them, um, but you want to give kind of like I think a warm smile in general. I mean, it depends on what they're talking about as well. Also, speaking of what they're talking about, make sure that you're reacting. If they're talking and you're kind of giving good eye contact, you can nod, you can give facial expressions to what they're saying as well. That's a lot, there's a lot of communication that goes on there. And again, this comes back to being present to the moment. So what you're experiencing in the conversation, um, show, but it should be in the conversation and not really what you're thinking about that happened in the past or the future or. All right, you guys, that's eye contact. I think I've said enough about this. Work on the basic principles of it. I'm probably gonna come out with more videos associated with conversations and eye contact is definitely a big part of the conversation. And it's also a big part of, you know, the first time you even walk up to someone. Usually the first thing that happens is the eye contact. So try and keep that gaze for just a second longer um, and see if that makes a difference in your life. So thanks a lot, you guys. Let me know what you thought about this video. If you made it to the end, consider subscribing. I come out with videos like this every single week. Thanks a lot and good luck out there. Thank <laughs> you.